Okay, I think we go ahead first. It's already 8.30. Okay. Good evening, everyone. Thank you for joining us today. We have uh, Madam Linda Law. She is a doTERRA user for almost six years, I think now. Yeah, six years, <laughs> yes. Uh, that's six years already. Uh, she's a mother to one beautiful girl, Phoebe, who is at the background being very quiet today. <laughs> <laughs> that's why she already said hi. What well, you didn't hear? Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, today, Linda has, um, she will be hosting today's class on women's wellness. So, uh, without further ado, I pass it to you, Linda. Go ahead. Okay, I would like to share the slides. Okay. So, can you all see the slides? Can you see, Babita? Yes, we can see. I can ah, see okay. the slide. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Good evening to everyone. Okay. I just want to share a short sharing of uh, why DoTerra. Okay. Um, okay. First, um, I have um, all our all DoTerra bottles is um comes with uh, uh testing. Okay, and uh, they have the uh, batch number in bottom of all the other labels, okay, if you can see. And um, and they have the expiry date and every batch number. So under this source to you, you can actually uh, be guaranteed that the uh, doTERRA bottle that you have, the lavender or the lemongrass is actually um, pure. There's no fillers and there's no uh, dilution and uh, it's very potent, right? So every bottle, is uh, manufactured um, and tested before coming to us. So that's the trust and the confidence um, I have in the doTERRA. And, um, and they also uh, give us and very open to provide the information and their testing to us, right? So this is something that, um, that I'm, that's why I'm using doTERRA for I think it's seven years. It's uh, one year before I actually become a member. I was actually using doTERRA already. So um, the personal experience, why? Because um, um, I started using is because uh, at that time of my daughter, she was um, she was uh, getting quite uh, often sick, like every month she would have uh, fever and then she would have this uh, flu cough and usually comes with um, yeah, some fever is uh, like a sh sh short period, but we have to see the doctor every 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 month, and it's really every month. And then doctor in the end, at that time she was uh, just four years old, and doctor yeah, as you go, then uh, they will have the standard uh, antibiotics, and you know, and um, and the uh, and for cough and for the flu, right? And so after that, um, second or third time, um, after that, then I I I try to find other solutions. So I asked around my friend, said, oh, why don't you try doTERRA? I said the eucalyptus is very good. Um, and um, and that time I was, um, so I asked her, where can I get it? Oh, this, is, this oil is actually, you have to buy from agent. They don't sell it off shelf. So at that time I joined, um, I joined uh, Kavita's uh, group, chat group. And then at the time she had a promotion. It was, um, I don't remember correctly, there's four oils, buy three for one at that time. So I think it was uh, On Guard, Easy Air, and uh, was On Guard, Easy Air, Lavender, I think, and free Rosemary. So, so I got that set and I started using and because it's just the essential that required. And, um, uh, and I started with the Easy Air for her, cough and a flu so and also on guard to boost her immunity when she's getting sick so um, I find that um, that she she get well if once just as she's starting you I, I apply it like three times a day okay and I make rollers so that uh, my parents can actually apply for her when I'm not around so um, so I find that she improved and um, and sometimes she do get sick, but then her span of her sick, I mean, her, she getting sick is uh, longer and become more seldom. 
So I, I, I find that um, her health improved. Of course, she is also um, uh, to cut down on uh, sugar, sugary stuff on her food. We also look out. Right? So I find that, um, that that's how I started using doTERRA, right? So after um, after after a while, I, I also start using for myself, right? Because I find that uh, um, besides, um, and I also became a member. So um, and I started sharing as well. So after that, I find that uh, even for myself, that is uh, very beneficial. So I started using um, some of the oils for my personal uh, care for, and for my daily um, skin care and also the daily uh, uh, usage, right? So, okay, I will go more into detail on all this personal uh, usage uh, in the uh, woman wellness, okay? And I'll elaborate more on that, okay? So the other thing is value for money. So as you can see that even if we, we paid like 100 ringgit for uh, one bottle of uh, lavender, but it can be, we can last very long. So normally my oils, if, if I, if I, even if I uh, make rollers for friends and share, it can last me about nearly half a year to one year, right? And it's, um, it's really value for money because um, it's very little usage each time. And I, even for, for my girl, I always dilute. So it's even uh, like uh, if I make a roller for her, like uh, 10 mil, I usually dilute quite a lot, like um, only five drop or even less for her. But I find it's very potent. So for her, I don't have to use a lot, but she, she you can see the effects, right? And uh, the benefits for her, even with uh, highlight dilution. Okay. Um, okay, uh, that's the first slide. I'll go on to the second. Okay, what are the, let me minimize this. Okay, you can see, I think this, uh, how, how do I uh, minimize? It's okay, it's full, it's full size, no worries. It's okay. Ah, I can see, yeah. Uh, ah, okay. we can see full size. Okay, oh, okay. So, um, so, okay, what are the things that uh, usually a woman um, has? Uh, they are actually the skin issue, right? Our, we have I like to look good, complexion, and also sometimes uh, some skin irritation. And uh, second one is uh, maybe emotional. If sometimes you get uh, very down and uh, also this one can link also to um, good sleep and uh, rest. And then the other one is hormone. Right, because uh, every month we have menstrual and uh, we um, we go through the monthly cycle, right? So sometimes uh, if we don't have enough sleep or, you know, or certain times we don't even um, get uh, proper food, then it can affect our hormone and also our, it also link to emotion indirectly, right? So if uh, this well-being is very interrelated, and um, I find as a well-being, you have to also look into all these emotional, uh, physical, as well as uh, the overall health balance. So overweight is also can be related to um, your emotional well-being because it's also uh, affect the uh, your eating habits and also um, okay. The other thing also you have to look into is to do a daily or some sort of uh, weekly exercise or some form of uh, physical activity, right? And uh, the other one is to focus, you know, because in today's world, I find that there's so many distractions. So in order to focus uh, even in um, at work or at, for, for concentrate to finish a task, you know, it sometimes um, takes a lot of effort, right? Because uh, this focus, sometimes we got so much in our mind and so many things uh, going on, right? So uh, these are the main uh, things that I find um, a woman could uh, are, are juggling with. So um, for all of you out there, you have anything else that you are you want to uh, raise? You know, you all can type on the chat box as well if you all feel that it's. Uh, <laughs> okay, if you don't feel that you want to um, 
Uh, any other uh, issue? Okay, then I can go on. Then anything you all want to ask, stress issue. Oh, yeah, yeah, stress issue. Actually, uh, yeah, stress issue also is something that we are juggling with. Something that we cannot control. But uh, with oils like balance, some some of the oils it can help. Um, also, uh, how say it, reduce this stress, and uh, and so I think it's also uh, to manage this stress. Yeah. Okay, I will go on to the next. Yeah, especially the pandemic when being at home. And I think uh, usually many mothers, right, have to juggle from being a, suddenly being a mother to being a teacher and also to <laughs> being a housewife, right? <laughs> so all in one. Yeah. And the canteen lady, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so being hungry and to make sure everyone have enough food and everyone is uh, good and we have enough supplies, right? <laughs> uh, what are the first eight? Okay, this one we can answer at the Q&A session as well. Let me go through the slides then anything else uh, we can, I can also add on my daily usage besides uh, the well-being that used for women. Okay, I go to the next slide first. Okay. Um, help boost the metabolism. Okay. So, so it's uh, for being uh, healthy. I feel that we, we need to uh, be fit and to be uh, to to be in a good body shape now because it's also linked to health issue as well as uh, well being, right? And also, if being overweight can also cause um, cause the person to be a bit sluggish and sometimes even to uh, we have low, low morale, you know, it links to also emotional issue. So it's good to, uh, if, if you feel that you're overweight based on your BMI, it's good to go through a program or a certain period like a targeted planning of, on trying to lose this weight, right? And uh, it's, it's also for, not just for looking good, but it's also for your well-being in the long run, right? So I suggest the oil that if you need to support this um, to achieve your being fit, right, is uh, Sim and Sassy, or they call it Smart and Sassy also now, right? So this Smart and Sassy is actually a blend. They have a grapefruit, uh, lemon, ginger, peppermint, and cinnamon, right? So it's a blend, and I find it's very useful if you need to um, not just to manage your anger, hunger craving when you ingest, you can also actually use it to inhale. How you do on inhale is you can put um, a drop on your hands, okay? And, uh, and, and, and to inhale, to cup like this. And, and if you, when you feel um, that you are being um, hungry early, so it can, and, and also before meals, so that you don't uh, overeat, right? And also while, it, while you inhale, it also give you a positive uh, mood because uh, grapefruit is similar to citrus, right? It helps improve and give you a positive mood, okay? And um, to, it also helps uh, besides uh, managing hunger craving, it will help boost your metabolism. So you can either intake it, uh, put under the tongue or you can mix it with water or mix it with a drink or you can uh, actually apply it around your waist okay and also um, to, to boost them especially if you know the, around the tummy area you feel you want to tone and also to um, to boost the metabolism there okay and um, this weight plan as I said is always combined with exercise and healthy eating but another thing is uh, very important is also sleep because actually if you read, if you don't have enough sleep, the um, brain usually will, um, you have more hungry cravings, you know, your tendency is also to, to eat more. So um, also sufficient sleep is very important, okay, besides healthy eating. And um, with the smart and sassy, you could help to also control the appetite. And if you have uh, eating disorder, it can help regulate it. Uh, you regulate the eating disorder. Like you, sometimes you feel like you, oh, you, you, have, you, you like to stuff yourself, you know? 
when you inhale before uh, meals, it can help you um, control and of course, um, try to portion up your food, okay? Normally, the tendency is when you go to um, eat out, right? So you order a bottle, bowl of noodles. So usually, they, it's always standard order. So it's good to always also control the portion. So you inform in advance to the, to the auntie or to whoever who is ordering that you, you, you need certain portion, like less noodle or you know you, you want half the portion because sometimes it's customized to everyone. So it doesn't really customize to... To, 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 to us, so you can have to always pre -em, you know, pre prepare in advance if you are ordering food to always portion out how much you're going to eat. So that will help also to uh, control uh, the amount to eat and also to, um, to prevent from overeating, right? And, uh, and uh, share food uh, is also quite dangerous where you actually take the food as you eat, right? So that is a bit uh, dangerous because you can't really see how much food you're eating. So I really suggest that to take advance what you wanted to eat and how much you portion it in the plate uh, and then before start, starting to eat. Okay, so that's something also I would suggest. Um, okay, the other one, it will help be very helpful. It, it would to help for skin toning and also to um, uh, with cellulite, right? Sometimes because as you lose weight, the tendency is uh, the skin can be, have cellulite. So this uh, climate, Smart and sassy also helps with this uh, cellulite and also visceral fat when you apply it, okay, regularly. <clears throat> okay, so... Uh, okay, so yes, uh, it also helps a lot, yeah, with toning and also drainage, yeah. So drainage of the um, lymphocyte, right? So it's, it's, it's um, something that you could use it and uh, for to manage your uh, weight, right? And also, if you can also alternatively, because uh, there's also a uh, great food, you can also substitute, you know, if you're not, you don't want to use the necessity, you can just use great food as well, right? Okay, that's the other option. Let's go to the next slide. Okay. Um, the next one is uh, focus, right? I find focus is very important, um, especially if you are working as well as um, being at home as well. If you are doing something uh, to stay focused and to be able to complete the task efficiently and uh, in a short time, right? So I, to encourage this focus, um, you, you can use uh, a few options. Right, uh, what I suggest is um, two blends and uh, two single oils, okay. So Intune is a blend, they have um, amaris, uh, patchouli, frankincense, lime, ilang, ilang, wood, and chamomile. And um, it can, uh, this bottle even is 10 mil roll-on, it can be further diluted. You can use like a uh, two mil and dilute with uh, eight mil FCO. Okay, and um, and it's very uh, even with uh, ten mil dilution, you can use up to two months, right? And so if you have a roller of in you can use up to ten months and can last you if you use every day. Okay, and another one which is my favorite also, which I diffuse every morning, is peppermint and wild orange, um, because it helps um, help me feel more alert and also uh, keep my mind active, okay? And um, yeah, Intune is smells really good, yeah. <laughs> okay, and then the other one is a Tinker, even though it's a kid's blend, it's a Vertiva, Peppermint, Clem Clementine, and also Rosemary, and yeah, that's a FCO, it's diluted, it's a kid's blend, but you can use also for adults. Okay, and um, it helps uh, with the uh, focus and also it can be used for your kids, okay, directly. Okay, so how do you um, apply? Okay, you can take, um, okay, let me find peppermint. Okay, you can take the peppermint, which um, sometimes I do also, I will dilute it. Okay, I will take uh, one drop. 
or you can put into rollers, right? And uh, so I got the small FCO, the 30 minute FCO, you see, the cute one that just, uh, so you just easy to carry around and um, you can just apply it either. You can apply in the back on the neck like this, or, or you can also, if you, you, I usually apply a bad neck, bad on the neck because at work, right? So I don't want to mess up my hair. But if you're at home, you can also apply at the scalp like this, you know? You can like, what Kavita always do a massage, you know? So you can apply all the 10 fingers together and uh, just massage from the front up to the back. You can see? So then you will feel a very uh, cooling sensation as you apply peppermint on your scalp. So it's very nice feeling uh, when you, after apply. So I usually mix with wild orange if I'm diffusing, and it's um, it also gives me a positive and um, happy mood, right? And I find these uh, blends are uh, really helps the attention, and also reduce anxiety and hyperactivity, like a lot of other thoughts coming in. Uh, it will reduce that. So you can stay focused and um, and also usually I do it when I in the morning if I feel that a bit sleepy or so and usually also during half time break after lunch. So that's also when I feel like a bit sluggish. I also it gives uh, the alertness right uh, after lunch usually like because it's already food in the tummy. So sometimes you feel a bit sluggish so you can also apply again after that. And after four hours, it's good to replenish the EO because it's already absorbed by the body. So, and also if alternatively, if you need uh, to replace coffee, because for me also, I cannot take like two cups of coffee a day. It just affect like it's, my tummy is, um, uh, I can't really take uh, two cups. So it helps replace coffee and um, morning wake up blend. So what I do is also I diffuse when I fetch my daughter to school because she's like a bit, sleepy, <laughs> uh, waking up early, right? And um, so it helps to wake her up on the way to school, yeah. Yeah, actually wild orange, yes, it's also one of my favorites, yeah. Okay, the other one is uh, being zen. It's also helped with actually not just being chilled, but also with stress. Um, and also uh, helps with sleep, okay? So being Zen is um, also not just uh, uh, being tranquil, but also it helps with uh, also stress and also uh, uh, uninterrupted sleep, right? So usually uh, oils like um, lavender balance and lavender peas, okay? Uh, oils that I use uh, I to, to help, help me into a Zen mode, right? And um, balance is actually a blend. There is a spruce, whole wood, frankincense, blue tansy, and blue chamomile. And uh, it is um, a very sweet fragrance. And everyone who I introduce balance will love it. So it's very uh, sweet uh, uh, smell um, and very nice. You can even use it as perfume. And it's something that I rely on, like, uh, to, during presentation, like now, <laughs> during uh, interviews also, you know, and um, and so it helps me a lot, uh, right? So you can you 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 it really um, helps a lot, you know. So when I I tell you my experience, once I was um, going for interview, uh, I was really uh, very. Uh, anxious, you know, before the interview. So when I apply it, after that, I really feel like, really don't feel any emotion. And I could really speak everything else and like, uh, well, for, well, for my mind. And then, um, and, and you can feel that it, even as I talk, there's no emotion, you know. So, I mean, no stammering or, you know, so it, it's instantaneous. So I usually apply it, um, balance on my wrist and, and everywhere. And then I put the peppermint also, so that I'll be alert, you know, to, to be able to respond to any question. So these are the two oils that helps me. And uh, another one is lavender piece. So yeah, so it helps also, yeah, it helps so very much with sleep and before, yeah, just to help with good sleep, right? 
So uh, lavender piece um, is a blend and it has uh, lavender, sweet majoram, chamomile, ylang ylang, uh, cedarwood, cedarwood, vertebral and vanilla. So this lavender piece uh, is an extra boost. They call it the sleep blend, right? So it helps um, sleep as in to put you to sleep as well as to keep you asleep. So it's something that will knock you off and, uh, and it really helps you stay uh, rested throughout sleep. So I find it's, it's very helpful. And, um, but even with lavender, right? Because it, lavender piece is the boost, but even with lavender, if I want to have a good sleep, I just put a drop on my pillow and just immediately I can feel the effect that I'm rested and, uh, and slowly I could unwind and, uh, you know, and, um, oh, you can, your daughter cannot sleep with lavender. Okay. Did you try lavender piece? <laughs> Even my daughter. So if I just put one drop lavender, I can see immediately within less than two minutes, she'll be asleep. I, I, I don't know. It, it really worked very fast. You know, if, if not, she, if you'll take like five minutes, then she'll be still turning, turning without the lavender. But I think you can also rotate. You can try with uh, blending with... Uh, maybe balance, you know, and maybe that will help. Or, or even uh, put a balance with lavender piece. You can try that plan as well and to see which one works for her. It's always a try and error because every individual is uh, unique. So each of us respond differently to different oils. Yeah. If, if, you can also try lavender with balance. Yeah. Okay, you can also try blends and to see how she responds to it. But maybe on that day, maybe it's, she's just alert because also other, other, in, um, other uh, in, like if we have a lot of uh, screen times or in the day they are now online classes. So sometimes they, they are overactive mind because being, uh, have to stay the whole, you know, like my daughter now is on school. So they like four hours classes on school on the computer. So that's actually um, something that we have to go through, but, but it, it, it is, is all the screen time also. And uh, that doesn't help with sleep if it's very, if it's the screen time is very near sleep as well. Okay. <laughs> yeah, most people do. Maybe she is one of the rare. Yeah, they just try with other blends. Okay, um, I've covered a uh, moment of tranquility. Okay, if I need a moment of, uh, if I'm very stressed, I need a moment to just chill out, I also apply balance. So that helps me cool down or, you know, or to uh, reduce my anxiety and my worries, right, at that time. So it's a moment, it's that emotion only. So that balance will help uh, stabilize the emotion for that particular moment, a few hours. So at the same time, we try to uh, you know, adjust in our mind to, to, re to, to reason whatever um, uh, event that happened, right? So it helps uh, at that moment when we are feeling that instant um, feeling of anger or, you know, or anxiety, right? And um, uninterrupted sleep, I, was, I mentioned before, is actually you can use lavender piece to remain asleep as well for long hours yeah and uh, meditation mode okay meditation mode so you, you can also just use oil when you are uh, doing your meditation praying okay and it helps to to bring you into a, um, a meditative mode right and uh, okay like I mentioned so panic attacks and feeling overwhelmed for that instant you get your oils and you in immediately you can address these emotions for that time while you try to rationalize and keep yourself calm, right? Okay, uh, I mentioned already uh, also anger and restlessness. Okay, uh, let's go to the next one. Why is not done? Okay, anti-aging blend, okay. As uh, as ladies, you like to look good, and uh, the blends I use is actually uh, two, which I find is uh, actually you can also use other oils, but I find these two is somehow uh, most appropriate. 
but of course it's not the only one, right? So like immortal is uh, actually frankincense, cedarwood, lavender, myrrh, helichrysum, and rose. Uh, it's a blend that you use uh, for uh, anti-aging. And this whole 10 ml bottles, you can also dilute, dilute up to one ml in each, and then uh, top up with nine ml of FCO. And it can last you at least, uh, I think one year and a half. One, uh, if you say two months, you can use, right? For each rollers, you have 10. So you can use our 20 months, which is nearly two years. Huh? <laughs> but if you use night and day, um, maybe you can, it's slightly uh, less than 20, 20 months. Huh? But I find that uh, I've been using Immortel. Um, if you, if I get enough sleep, if I don't, you know, I don't sleep like four, three, four hours, uh, my skin will not break out. Okay, uh, because um, since I started using Immortel, my skin improved a lot. Right, you should, previously I used to have breakouts and uh, and during, uh, especially during the monthly period. But now it's uh, also maybe because age already, right? <laughs> so so it seldom break out as much. And, uh, but I, I'm sure the oil really helps, uh, really, really um, to balance up my, uh, my skin um, and my, the skin, uh, the skin um, condition. It, it's not, so, not, not as oily, you know, and um, it, it, it's, uh, it's much better now. And uh, Yarrow POM was something I also used um, to alternate with, uh, with Immortel daily. I find both is very good. So I use it actually um, before my moisturizer. So I usually apply after washing, I put toner, then I apply either uh, Immortel or, or Yarrow POM. Then I would uh, then put, apply the moisturizer and also a sunblock. So that's uh, how I usually go through my morning routine for my face. Okay, I find it helps reduce um, also lines and uh, and my blemish, I used to have uh, also some uh, you know scar, if scarring from uh, pimples and all, it's reduced very much, and it helps also with um, age spots. But the um, as I mentioned, I put a sunblock, so sunblock is very important, at least SPF uh, thirty five and above, and need to reapply if you're long hours in the sun, right? And uh, okay, the, the, these oils are also very good for if you have any skin injury or you went through um, some operation, you apply it and it will get well very fast and, uh, and it will heal nicely, right? And uh, for you, of course, uh, after reducing all these wrinkles, scarring and, uh, and age spot, you, you're, Definitely, the complexion become more useful, right? <laughs> and um, and yeah, it's, it's immortal really. Uh, all the precious oil. If you top, uh, yeah, top five oils, precious oil is all in immortal. Like cedarwood, frankincense, uh, helichrysum, rose. Okay, top five <laughs> most expensive oils, <laughs> all in one bottle. Uh, for you okay so you don't need to mix and blend but as i said you can also use individually you can use just lavender or you can use just helichrysum for your skin you know and rotate among these oils that's also uh, good okay and let's go to the next one hormone okay the one thing uh, for hormones and emotional uh, balance pms these two oils is uh, very helpful uh, they are also blends um, and which uh, doTERRA made, you know, to cater directly to address these issues. So Caricom uh, is a blend with, uh, for, with Clarice Hege and uh, lavender, bergamot, uh, chamomile, cedarwood, ylang ylang, uh, geranium, fennel, carrot seed, palmarosa, and vitex. Okay, so you can use this, um, you can further dilute as well. Uh, two meals to eight meals um, FCO in a roller. And uh, the other option is to use Whisper. Okay. Uh, how uh, Whisper is actually uh, from FCO. There is a patchouli, 
uh, bergamot peel, there's also cedar wood, there's also rose and then vanilla bean, jasmine, cinnamon bark, vetiver, uh, and um, lardanum uh, leaves, and also um, cocoa seeds, and also ilang ilang flower. Okay, so these are uh, the blend, and so uh, whisper is five mil, but you can further also dilute and. Um, Maybe you can also dilute one mil to one mil of FCO, right? Yeah. So this um these two oils I find is uh, good, but clary clam has a very nice smell, so you can use it as perfume as well. So, uh, you can apply at the wrist or behind our ear, okay? And for um menstrual, you can apply up to like one week before your menstrual and during the menstrual period, okay? Um, and you can alternate the oils, carry calm and whisper as well. Okay, so these um, oils help with uh, premenstrual reliever, stress reliever. It helps reduce your emotional, you know, before PMS, before the period. And also it helps with um, hormone balance and also help to regulate, uh, reduce pain you have. And for those older women, if they have hot flushes, you can use it to, you know, somehow um, reduce the effect. But you can also indirectly, if to reduce the uh, the heat, to to use peppermint. Peppermint can reduce the heat at that moment. If you, if uh, the person feels uh, that the body is uh, heating up, especially at night, you apply peppermint and um, at the spine or and behind the head to reduce the, the hot flushes, right? And uh, okay, for heavy menstrual, it helps to reduce, you know, to, to regulate your menstrual and mood swings. Also for cramping, you know, and period cramps. I okay, can also use uh, deep blue rub as alternative as well to, uh, to help with the pain, right? And also you can use also with hot pack, hot pack, hot water pack. Right to uh, during after you apply the oils, you can use hot water pack to let the oil uh, permeate deeper into the skin. Right? Okay. Um. <laughs> now mine is okay. After you finish the ten mil, then after the next ten mil, you can dilute now. Nah. Why Ming? Um, yeah, all the oils, uh, doTERRA oils can be dilute and, and actually it doesn't, uh, how to say, affect the effectiveness, it, it's just as, as good and uh, even as I dilute, I find that uh, the smell even is just as good and um, like I make rollers with, uh, for lavender peas and balance, so at, even apply people say, wow, it smells so good but it's already diluted, I use only like for 10 mil. I use up to, I use a bit more. I think I use up to 15 drops. And, and it just uh, smells as good, you know, as, as without dilution. And it's, it's, it's better because it actually helps the skin absorb the uh, EO as well as the, it helps it per permeate deeper into the skin, right? So always dilute because it's making your money worth it as well. So it's, uh, it doesn't reduce any, any benefits. Okay. 